Honor to you, stranger. Your appearance is most fortunate. My situation here has taken a distressing turn, and you could be of great assistance to me. For months now, I've been studying how the Brothers of Strife were created. These ruins are fascinating, but ruins can reveal only so much. I need a brave person to visit the past and tell me what actually happened that day. I've concocted a ritual to summon spirits present on that day. Talk to whoever appears. This should imbue you with the essence of that moment. You'll also need to find the Heartstones. Then we can open the gateway to the past. Mind the stories the spirits tell you. There's much to be learned from talking to the dead. These violent statues depict the horrors of the past, when the elven Kaima fought the invading human needs. This was the birthplace of the mightiest magic the Kaima ever conceived. As a Telvani, I must know everything. These are the Brothers of Strife, immortalized in stone. It was here our ancestors, the Kaima, made their final stand against the Needs. And it was here they created the Brothers of Strife. Yes, that is my house, three be praised. While the other houses have entangled themselves in this Ebonheart Pact, our wizard lords, in their wisdom, have kept us apart. Power comes through knowledge, ancient and modern. Wait, this is where the final battle took place. Why am I here? All my life I fought for the Kaima. I skirmished with Dwemer and drove beasts from the Ashlands until a greater threat loomed. The Need struck Stonefalls with a lust for territory and slaughter. They were men of the North, violent and cruel. My brother and I were the greatest generals of the Kaima. Yet even we couldn't stem the tide of Nedic muscle and iron. We were desperate. The sorcerer's plan to create the Brothers of Strife offered us a way out. Of course we did. We were losing. Our homeland, everything we'd fought to build, was about to fall to these vile humans. There could be no peace with the Needs. I became one of the Brothers to serve my people.
I know this place. We made our last stand here many years ago. Gone. Why am I here? Why have I been summoned? We fell back, retreating from fort to stronghold. Whole companies were lost, defending our people. The needs besieged our cities and burned our farms. Our sorcerers made a plan, and we lured the humans here. We drew a line in the ash. At this temple, we declared we would go no further. My troops held the line in the riverbed below, while Sadal and I made the sacrifice. We became the Brothers of Strife, and as brothers ended this war. You have spoken to the spirits. What did you learn? General Balroth and Legate Sadal. My calculations were correct. Not that I expected any less. By talking to them, you're now attuned to the final clash between Kaima and Need. Now, all you have to do is step into the past. Of course, I forgot. You did not conceive this plan. In the base of the statue, just north of here, is a shrine dedicated to Boethia. Go there and offer the Heartstones to the brothers. There is one thing to know. I don't want to waste this opportunity because you made a foolish mistake. Those in the past will see you as one of Balweth's soldiers. Act the part. I can't say what will happen if you don't. History lessons? Very well, if you insist. Do they teach nothing these days? Long ago, we were the Kaima, with light skin and fair eyes. We worshipped the good Daedra. To mark the ascent of the three, we were gifted with this more sober complexion, and the realm of Morrowind forever. A more obscure topic, certainly. In ancient days, the Nidic tribes marched and plundered across the land. We call their descendants Nords. Even then, they were fearsome warriors who lusted for conquest. Early in the First Era, when the Kaima were still new to Morrowind, the Nids invaded. The battle that brought Sadal and Balreth here was the climax of that war. The Kaima were forced to desperate measures to prevail. Great power ripped open a way to oblivion here, and that can never fully be shut. Scamps are the skeevers of those realms, wriggling through the gaps. Ill-smelling, fire-spewing skeevers who killed my assistants and drove me from the ruins.
You judge us from another era, but you should know, we could have chosen power or chosen death. If power destroyed the enemy, then nothing else matters. The Kaima were powerful. We thought we could face any challenge. Even at the end, we were arrogant and proud. But I will not believe our sacrifice was in vain. Halt, soldier. The needs are amassing just beyond the ridgeline. I need to speak to General Bolruth. Have you seen him? You're just in time. Our people are being slaughtered. General Bolruth needs to prepare at the altar. We've got some dirty business ahead. It's time to teach these savages what it means to cross the Kaima. Blood for blood, their violence shall be repaid. Soldier, are you ready to begin? Kill the knee troops. Make the river run red with their blood. Take their hearts as trophies. Once you've decimated the front lines, the need chieftain must pay. We, the Kaima, have paid enough. Now it is the enemy's turn. Just so. The Need's war chief is named Onska. Kill her and cut out her heart. When you have these sacrifices in hand, head to the ritual altar in the center of the temple. We'll be waiting. This is justice. That the blood of fallen Needs will open the way for their defeat. Go, soldier. Kill the troops and slay Onska. Then report at the ritual altar. Our retreat here was no accident, soldier. Only at this place of Daedric power can we complete the ritual of calling. We'll wrench the Daedra from their dark plane, split them open, and use their power and need blood to save our people.
Help Sorcerer Tyrone with whatever she needs to prepare the ritual. Our lives and perhaps the future of our people rely on seeing this through, no matter what the cost. Quickly, soldier. Speak with Tyrone. We have little time left, and my brother grows angrier by the moment. Honor to you, soldier. I'll take the bloody offerings and ready them for the ritual. Are you prepared for the next step? Kill the Daedra at the nearby ruins. Take what we need from them. We are gathering the essences of these Daedra. Speak with the Acolytes. They know how to summon them. You're only a soldier, so I'll spare you details. We're infusing the blood of our enemies and the Daedric essences you collect into our chosen vessels. The General and his brother have volunteered themselves for this... sacrifice. The General and his brother will die. The power they receive will consume them. But they will be reborn, more fearsome than even the mightiest horde of need warriors. We, the Kaima, will win this day. I need help! I don't know if I can go through with this, soldier. These sorcerers ask much. Everything, in fact. They've created a spell to fill us with raw elemental power, greater than our enemies can stand, if it works. What they can't say is what happens to us. Will my brother and I still remain, or will we be nothing but beasts of destruction? Yes, I must be. I wonder what the lens of history will show when our people look back on this day. Will my brother and I be remembered as the saviors of our race? Or will we be known as monsters and horrors? Sadal and I are ready to make the sacrifice. We have only a few moments. The needs are about to break the line. But Sadal and I will save our people and be remembered forever. Help the sorcerers complete the ritual. Pray at the brazier, soldier. Pray for the destruction of our enemies. For the Kaima! For Vela!
return. What did you learn? Need blood. I should have seen this. The Kaima thought they were gods. Backed into a corner, they turned to dark rituals. This was dangerous magic. I must contemplate this. Still, I am quite grateful that you did not fail. We Dark Elves thought ourselves unassailable in Stoneforce. Now the Covenant stands at our gate, threatening to burn the barn and scatter the Guar. Interesting how the past repeats itself. Come <laughs> on. 